some of these drills if they did well at them at the combine. So, um, you know, I try to try to put on a good showing. So. What did you say you ran the 40? Uh, four six zero is what Coach Doyle had me. So. Wow. What was your goal going in? Was that uh, probably in the four sixes? I was just hoping for. Okay. So I didn't really know what to expect for sure. You'd be pretty pleased with that, I assume. Yeah. I'm happy with that too, so. <clears throat> what kind of side conversations have you had? You know, whether it's here or just brushing up with scouts um, in the hallways and stuff. Yeah, um, probably been in contact with about ten or so teams. Um, just uh, a couple meetings, you know, on the whiteboard and in the film room, um, and then just different teams see me in different spots, um, which is which is fine. Uh, you know, some see me as a guy that can put on weight and play inside. Mm -hmm. um, Others see me still as a same backer, so it just kind of depends from team to team. And it's such a sub package <clears throat> league. I think it's 70% sub package. Mm -hmm. So, I mean, you could be inside on one play, outside on the other. Special teams, I'm sure, has a heavy component as well. Right? Yeah. Um, like you said, a lot of sub packages. Um, you know, I'll just do whatever I can to, to get on the field or make a roster, really. So, um, just. Hopefully, I, you know, I can get an opportunity and then just put my best foot forward and work hard for it. So. What was that like for you? I mean, you started 40 games at a Big Ten school and mm -hmm. had a lot of success. Not to be able to go to the combine, or was that deflating, <laughs> angering? I mean, um, you know, obviously I'd rather be there than mm -hmm. be watching out at the couch, <laughs> on the couch at home. But, uh, you know, it is what it is. So, you know, I had a, had a shot to uh, just show myself in front of every team today. And, you know, hopefully they liked what they saw. Most of it kind of reminds him of high school, kind of being under the radar mm -hmm. and just kind of having to do you see any of that. Uh, you prove yourself all over again. Yeah, you know, both Bo and I under recruited. Um, not not a lot of scholarship offers. Um, and three so, year starters. Yeah, um, you know, it's a lot of Iowa guys. I feel like have been underrated. Uh, a lot of two three star kids. Um, so a little bit, I would say, resembles. In some aspects, yeah. How does this place help you for the NFL? Um, just ex-players talking about um, just all the, the work you put in here and, you know, the camp schedule and all that type of thing that it, it just translates and is very similar to the, the NFL structure. So. Yeah, James was saying structure here is a big part of what mm -hmm. stands out to him yeah. once you're ready. Um, you know, here, a lot of accountability, a lot of discipline. Um, you know, and if you want to be successful at the next level, you have to have those traits and characteristics, I think. So. Thanks, appreciate it. Yeah, thank you. What were you uh, probably 6'3", 240, 235? Yeah, I was uh, 6'2", and 7'8", so 6'3", basically, and then 235 today. Okay. So, What'd you, know. you do with your, uh, with your be uh, bench? I only got 15, so that's the one thing I'm not, I'm not happy about. Mm -hmm. But um, it was the last thing we did, so a little dead going into it um, yep. compared to the training. But. Yeah, other than that, I'm, I'm happy with my testing, so 